For these secondary school students from Cross River State, it's turning out to be a case of the young bearing the brunt of a bad situation they did not create. They resumed to lock school gates and a notice to return home as classes had been put on hold till further notice. While their counterparts have taken the national examinations, they are caught in the middle of a bitter squabble between members of the Nigerian Union of Teachers and the Cross River State Government. My appeal to the government is that they should please pay their salaries so that they can give us access to our education because we are supposed to write our exams. But because of the strike, we couldn't complete our examinations. They have not promoted most of our primary school teachers, and this, and this is bad. And when, this is, and when it is like this, primary school teachers will not be happy and will to be, they will be forced to go on strike, which is now affecting our exams now. Non-payment of salaries and inadequate welfare packages have been a long-standing issue between teachers in Nigeria and the states that take on their payroll. The storyline has not changed much, and these public school teachers in Cross River are making an all too familiar demand to get paid for the work they've done. We also have an issue of... Uh no remittance of uh, check of dues. 2017, uh, April and May dues, our own union dues was deducted. I had not been, since April and May 2017, we have written, we have dialogue. About 70 or, or so percentage of the teachers are not, are not enjoying promotion, and they have their lead. And they are still in the same system with those who have enjoyed promotion. The state government says it understands the concerns of the teachers, but also appeals that they in turn understand the plight of the children who are missing their national examinations. We are resolving those issues. Um, exams are, you know, being written on time, and I don't think uh, the intention to truncate it is fair to our children. So we are trying to resolve those issues with labor, and by God's grace, within the next few hours, like tomorrow, the matter will be resolved. There is a high possibility that the repercussions of this action is a delay in the completion of their curriculum, an endless cycle of delay in the academic calendar.